Hey, how's it going? My name's Clay, up here at Capital Chrysler Jeep Dodge in Garner, all right off Highway 70. Just wanted to stop and take some time to introduce you guys the 2010 Dodge Journey SXT. It's a family vehicle to get, get everybody around. It's a 3.5 liter V6 high output engine with uh, 235 horsepower. This one actually does have a couple uh, fog lights on it. I'm gonna come on around this way. Basically, it's got automatic windows and locks. It's got the, the on steering wheel audio controls, power, heated seats. Underneath the front seat, there's a little storage area. You know, lady could hide her, her purse, her wallet, anything that's of value that you don't want anybody to see just looking in the car. Uh, the Dodge Journey is actually one of the only uh, vehicles in its class that has a, the ability to have a third row seat in it, and it's very simple to use. Basically, all you do is just flip this leather and the seat just slides right up. And this does have a five-star crash rating on front and passenger as well as the, the back. You've got controls for the air and heat in the second row on, on each side. There actually is storage in the floor. Um, you can, in fact, remove this bin so you could put like ice and stuff and keep drinks cool in there. If you want to come to the back, I'll show you how this third row works. Basically, with the third row up, You've got a little bit of storage back here, plus a little hidden space that you can put some stuff down in. Uh, but the seats are real simple, again, to fold down. All you do is just grab right here and push it down. Real simple to use. And then you just pull them back up. But it's got, a, it's got a lot to offer. Satellite radio and everything. This is, the, this is the chill zone. You can keep a couple 12 ounce cans in there. It runs with the air conditioning. So you can keep your drinks cool when you're on the road. Just grab one, drink it up. But we need you to come out and take a test drive with us. Come on out and come see me up at Capitol.